Are we here now in this moment of peace, love, joy, and truth? Are we here now in this moment of understanding ourselves as divine and all things as the truth of consciousness within our own being? Do we understand that God's grace is working in us, through us, around us, that everything we are doing is conscious of the divine energy within us? That we are aware of God's grace working through us, in us, around us? Are we seeing ourselves as divine in each and every moment of every day? Are we allowing ourselves to be that divine unity consciousness that we are and that we share with everyone around us? Do we see that the energy of God's grace is working through us, in us, around us, in everything we are doing? Have you come here to do a special purpose on this earth plane at this time? Have you come here to do something special on this earth plane? Do you know why you are here? Do you know what you are doing? Do you know that the divinity within you rests within you as the peace and love and joy and truth of everything? So what is it that you're doing? Why are you here? Is it a question we've asked ourselves over and over again? What am I doing and why am I here? Why have I come here? What have I done? So do we see within ourselves that divine consciousness and that bliss and that truth and that love that calls us into each moment and the truth of each moment and the purity of each moment and the joy of each moment? How many times have we asked ourselves that question, right? How many times have we seen ourselves as the divine consciousness of all things that can see the truth, right? We can see the truth. We can see the truth of all things. We can see the divinity within everything around us. We can see the absolute purity of each and every being that's coming here to be seen on this earth plane. We can see that everything we are doing is a conscious representation of the energy of consciousness within our own being. We can see that as we walk into the world in a certain way, as we access consciousness, the consciousness within our own being, we can see that everything we are doing is divine and light and free. I'm allowing myself to be who I came here to be. I'm allowing myself to be who I came here to be. What is that energy of grace that's working through us that says, I am who I am. I am what I am. I am doing the energy of grace within my own being. Have I come here to understand my grace? Have I come here to see my grace? Have I come here to know my grace? Am I here now in this moment of peace and love and joy, contemplating the divinity of all things, contemplating the essence of my own grace, of my own peace, of my own love? Am I here now in this moment experiencing God's grace within my own being so that I can access the consciousness of all things, right, and every being that I see? I am awake, I am aware, I am free, I am divine, I am conscious, I am allowing God's grace to be seen within me. So now I allow for some truth to be seen, right? What is the truth that we're allowing to be seen within our being? I'm allowing for the truth of why am I here? What is that truth, right? Why am I here? Why am I here? Why am I here? So what is that truth that's being seen within our own being right now in this moment of divinity and peace? Do we know that the truth and the consciousness within all things is our truth, is our consciousness, is our grace? Do we know that as we aspect ourselves into consciousness as the grace and the truth that we are already, we see that things are opening up to us in a divine divine loving conscious way and when things are opening up to us in a divine loving conscious way the question of why am I here becomes seen 
what is the question of why am I here? Why is it approaching me now at this time, in this dream, in this energy, in this consciousness of grace? Why do I see myself opening up to that consciousness within my own being? Why do I know that what's inside of me is inside of everything and every being that has ever been and will ever be? Why do I know that the existential question of why am I here is conscious within me right now and is seeing and wanting to be seen? As I ask myself the question and as I go deeper into my own beingness of why am I here and what am I doing and what is this earth plane all about anyway, right? What are we asking? What are we asking when we ask that question? What is this earth plane all about? Why am I here? What is consciousness? What is grace? What is truth? What is peace? What are all of these things that are presenting themselves to me in the daily world of, of consciousness and grace every single day? What is it that I am seeking within that grace? What is, what is it that I am seeing? Do I go deep within my own being and ask the question, why am I here? Do I go deep within my own seeking and ask the question, what am I doing? Why am I free? Am I allowed to be free? Am I allowed to be free on this earth plane? Is it consciousness and awareness that allows me to be free on this earth plane? Do I allow myself to give into the graces of God's consciousness and bliss? Or do I expect myself to be seen as different than who I truly am? Because who I truly am is who I've come here to be, isn't it? And who I truly am is who I'm asking myself now. Why am I here and what am I doing? Who am I truly? Why does consciousness come through me in the way that it comes through me? Why does consciousness allow me and accept me and want me and divin me into the world in the way that has divin me? Why am I giving my peace to everything and everyone around me in the way that I give my peace to everything and everyone around me? Why is my consciousness, why is my grace opening up to God's divinity in this moment, in this time, in the way that it is? I've come here to see myself as divine. That is my true essence. That is my true peace. That is my true divinity. Can I see that everything I am doing is divine in this world and consciousness and grace and there is nothing that could be seen as differently than me? Can I know that everything I am doing is consciousness, is grace? Can I know that everything I am doing is giving me a way to be seen in this world? Do I know that what I am doing right now, right here in this moment, is the consciousness of grace, is the truth, is the divinity, is the peace? Do I know that what I am doing right now is the consciousness to be seen in the world around me? I know that I am opening up my grace. I know that I am opening up my peace. I know that I am opening up the divinity within me to be seen in everything and everyone around me. So why am I here and what am I doing? What have I seen within my own being that allows me to access that consciousness that says, I am truth, I am peace, I am love, I am divine. I know that as I access that consciousness within me of I am truth, I am peace, I am love, and I am divine, that I see everything as truth around me. I've come here to be the one that I have come here to be. Stop squashing ourselves down into some Something that is not our true reality. Stop squashing ourselves down into something that does not fit who we are and who we have come here to be. Stop squashing ourselves down into something that is not the divinity, that is not the peace, that is not the truth, that is our own true being. Why have I come here? What am I doing? What is my peace? What is my divine understanding of God's grace in, in this truth, in this reality? How have I come here? Why have I come here? What am I doing? What is the truth within me? Why is it wanting to be seen? Why is it opening up to the grace in all things. I have come here as my true self, as my divine true self, and I am accessing that consciousness of all things as I am my true self, as I am everything, as I am the oneness, as I am the peace. I know that I've come here to be seen as a gracious, kind, loving being of divine consciousness now. Why have I come here? What am I doing? Is that the question to be asked? Is that the question to be seen? Why have I come here? What am I doing? Is it conscious? Is it light? Is it true? Why have I come here? What am I doing? I am not accessing a consciousness that is not true within my own being anymore. I am done accessing a consciousness that is not true within my own being. It is time for me to step into my truth, step into my peace, step into my love, step into my divinity. It is now time for me to be the person that I am all 
already. It is now time for me to access the consciousness of everything that I am. It is now time for me to step into that divinity that I was put here with in the first place, in the beginning. I know that my consciousness, my truth, my peace, and my love are here already. I want to access them. I want to see them. I want to open them up to the consciousness now. I want to experience that divinity within me as the truth of all things. So let's go. Let's go into that place of divine understanding right now. Let's see that the consciousness within us is the consciousness of all things. Let's see that the truth within us is the truth of all things. Let's be the one that we came here to be right here now in this moment. Experience your peace and know your God's grace within you as the divine essence of all things. So truth is within you. Experience it. Truth is within you right now. Experience it. Truth is within you right now. Experience it. If you have accessed the consciousness within your own true self and you have seen the divinity of all things and you have recognized that God's grace is within you as you, right? And the peace of all things is you as you. So what do you want? Ask yourself the question, why am I here? What am I doing? Right now in this moment, am I experiencing the grace and the truth of God's energy within my own being? Right now, right here in this moment, am I experiencing the oneness, the truth, and the peace of everything that is already? I can see the consciousness within my own being. I can experience that grace within me, and I can see that everything I am doing is divine in this moment. So expect yourself to be great as you access that consciousness within your own being. Expect yourself to be wonderful as you see the grace within all things. Expect yourself to know the truth of your beingness as you know right now in this moment that everything is divine within you because we are divine. We are divine. We are divinity. We are peace. We are love. That's it. That's who we are. There is nothing else that can be done, nothing else that can be seen, nothing else, because we are the truth of all things. The truth that has given us consciousness is the truth that wants to be seen within our own being right now. Are you experiencing that consciousness within your own being? Are you allowing that consciousness to be known? Are you allowing that consciousness to be seen and heard by your true self of divine understanding? Are you allowing yourself to know the truth within you right now? Are you allowing yourself to see the space within your own being right now? Are you allowing that consciousness of God's grace to come through you as you because you are here with a purpose, with a reason to give God's grace to everything and everyone around you? Have you seen that the grace that comes through you is the grace of God's consciousness coming through you as the divine light? We are that light. We are that peace and we are that divinity. Why do we play small? Why do we play less? Why do we play like we are not that divine graciousness and truth that we are? Because we have come here to be seen as the light of God's grace and God's consciousness and God's peace. As we open up to the consciousness within our own being, we allow access to everything we've ever wanted. We know the truth of our own beings is within us. We know that. We have experienced that and we have expressed that and we have seen that God's grace comes through us as everything that we need. So now where are we going with this peaceful energy of God's grace within our being? Allow yourself to see. Journey within your own being. Allow yourself to experience. Journey within your own truth. Allow yourself to know. Look within your own being for what is real and what is true because that is the only place you will ever find anything that has meaning and depth in your world and your reality. You are the depth of your own being. You are the truth of your own being. You are the acceptance of your own self into yourself as yourself. You have seen yourself as divine grace within your own being and you experience God's grace within you in everything around you because the everything around you that we see is only the essence of our own being. So we accept that into our being now and we experience that grace within our being now 
and we know that God's grace is rushing through us right now as the feeling, right, of God's grace coming through us. We feel it, know it, feel it, experience it. I am feeling God's grace within me. I am seeing God's grace within me. I am knowing God's grace within me. That's the energy of God's grace, that God's consciousness and God's peace that we see and that we seek. We know that God's grace is within us. Why do we play to be something small? Why do we play to be something different? Why do we play that we are not that truth of all things? We know that God's grace is the truth within us as all things, and we know that this is the moment to be seen. If you are not the truth of all things, then how could you have come here as a play of divine consciousness on this earth plane? If you are not the truth of all things, then how have you come here to be grace and to be truth and to be peace? How have you come here to be this divine energy of light? How have you come here to see yourself as anything less than divine is not truthful? To see yourself as anything less than divine is not real. To see yourself as anything less than divine is not the essence of God's grace that is within you as you, as the inherent grace that rests in everything and everyone. There is no exception to this rule. We are all grace. We are all peace. We are, we are all divine and we are all love. There is no exception to this rule. I have found myself in the divinity of all things. I have found myself in the truth of God's grace within me. I have found myself as I walk through this world. The consciousness within me is the consciousness of all things. I have seen it, right? I have seen it. I have found it. I, I have seen the truth of my own beingness. Walk into your own grace. Walk into your own truth. Walk into your own beingness. Walk into your own essence of divinity right now and say, why am I here? I am here because I am a divine being of love. I am a divine being of light. This is me. I am truth. I am spaciousness. I have seen my grace within my own being. I know me. I feel me. I am the essential self. Allow it and recognize it. What is the essential self of all things? What is the essential self? The essential self of you, the essential self of me, the essential self of everything that ever was and ever will be. What is that essential self? Allow yourself to open up to it right here now in this moment. Allow yourself to open up to that essential self right here now in this moment. That is the seeking. That is it. Allow yourself to open up to the essential self right here now in this moment. That is the seeking. That is the divinity that you are wanting. The essential self right here now in this moment. Allow yourself to feel it. Allow yourself to know it. Allow yourself to experience it. Go deeper into it. Go deeper into the feeling of it. Allow yourself to feel it more deeply. Allow yourself to experience it within the essence of your truth right now. I am here, I am now, I am in this moment of peace. I am here, I am now, I am experiencing God's grace within me. I am here, I am now, I am knowing myself as divine in everything I am doing. Essential consciousness, essential grace, essential peace can be seen. It can be seen. It can be felt, it can be heard, it can be known. If you are here now in this moment you're in, and you are experiencing the peace of all things and God's grace is within you, then why do we not allow ourselves to be that in every moment of every day? right? Why do we not allow ourselves to be that in every moment of every day? It's our truth. It's our truth. We are that. We are the divine essence of all things. Why are we not allowing that in every moment of every day? Have you asked yourself that question? Why do I walk my, through my day as if I am not conscious, if I, as if I am not divine, as if I am not truth? Why have I walked through this day, these days without allowing myself to be the acceptance of God's grace within my own being? Why do I walk through these days in my life accepting something other than what I am truly on this earth plane? Because as we step up and we allow the divinity to be seen within our being, guess what? We're allowing that divinity to be seen in every single being that is around us in every single day. You are stepping into the consciousness of your own grace, not just for you. You are stepping into the consciousness of your own grace because that's who you are on this earth plane. And guess what? That allows every being in your presence to be seen as the grace of God's consciousness and bliss within their own true being. Have we come here to be great? Have we come here to be divine? Have we come here to be truthful? Have we come here to be seen as our grace? Don't play small. 
Don't play small. We are the bigness and the truth and the peace and the love of God's grace within us. We are not playing small anymore. It is not time to pretend we are not that. It is not time to pretend that we are something other than who we truly are on this earth plane. Wake up to your divinity. Wake up to your truth. Wake up. It's seen right now here in this moment. It's not hard. It's not hard. You don't have to try. Be you as you in this moment right now. Experience your grace. Experience your truth. Experience your divinity. Open up to it right now. Explode into your divine consciousness. We are bliss. We are love. We are truth, we are joy. Feel it. Feel it coming through you as you in the divinity of all things. If you just open up your heart chakra, open up your heart chakra and see the, divi the divinity, the grace, and the truth within your own being. I'm feeling you. I'm feeling you, and I'm knowing you, and I'm experiencing you, and I'm loving you, and I'm allowing you to be who you are right here now in this moment. I'm allowing you because I am being that. And as I be that, I allow you to be that. And as you be that, you allow everyone to be that in your presence and in your grace. Why have we come here? That's why we've come here because we are the divine essence of all things and we found our truth within our own being and we know that truth within our own being and we're sharing that truth with everyone and everything. We are that grace, right? It's so simple. We are that grace. This is God's grace. This is God's truth. This is God's peace. Don't ignore your divinity as we sit here in this moment of peace. Don't ignore it because I am the grace of all things and I'm allowing you to be the grace of all things and you're allowing me to see myself as I am divine in all things and I am the consciousness of all things and you are the consciousness of all things and we have allowed ourselves to be God's grace in this moment right now, right here as we experience grace. Everything is divine around us. Everything is experiencing that light around us. Watch the lights. See them flicker? Do you see the lights flicker? Do you see them fly? We are that grace. We are that light. We are that truth. We are that peace. The only thing that we see is God's grace within us and everything around us is that flickering of God's quote, quote, quoting, quoting God's grace within us and everything we are doing. We are quoting that grace within us and everything we are doing and we are feeling it and we are knowing it and we are experiencing it. I am the grace of all things. I am the grace of all things. I am the grace of all things. Know me, feel me, experience me, see me. I feel you. I know you. I experience you. I see you. I love you. And everything we are doing is God's grace. I love you in this true moment of peace. I love you in this true moment of energy and consciousness and grace. I love you as we seek each other, as we come together in peace and love and divinity and truth. Why else would we want anything else on this earth plane? We have come here to be great. We have come here to be divine. We have come here to be truthful. We have come here to be the one that we came here to be. Why am I here? I'm here to be divine essence, divine truth, divine grace within my own being. And I express that in the world as the way I express that. It doesn't really matter because we are the grace of all things and we express everything that we are from within our being. And that is the truth of all things. And that is the consciousness and that is the peace and that is the love. I have come here to be divine. I have come here to be peaceful. I have come here to be loving. I am that energy of grace within my own being. You no longer have to pretend that you are something other than what you truly are in this earth plane. You no longer have to pretend that you are something other than who you truly are within your own being. You no longer have to pretend that you have accepted something other than your true self as your divine being of light. You are now here in this moment and you're accepting your true self as your true self, as the divine essence of all things. Accept yourself. I accept myself into my own divine beingness right now. I accept myself into my own divine beingness right now. I accept myself into my own divine beingness right now. Look how amazing I am in this place of peace. Look how divine I am. Look how open I am. Look how aware I am. Look at me in this divine moment of peace and see me as the divine essence that I am. I accept you into my grace. I accept you into my consciousness. I accept you into my peaceful place of divine energy. You've known yourself as this. You've seen yourself as this. You've experienced yourself as this. Now we will no longer play small. We will no longer allow ourselves to see ourselves as anything than the grace and the consciousness of all things. If you have to listen to this 10, 10 times, 20 times, I don't care. Remind yourself, I am the grace of all things. I am seeing myself as divine grace. I am seeing myself as divine peace. I am seeing myself as divine love. I will no longer walk through the world as less than I am. I will no longer walk through the world as something other than who I truly am on this earth plane. I will no longer walk through the world as something less than who I truly am. I will not do it. I make a commitment to myself right here, right now, that I will no longer walk through this world as less than I am. I am the divine consciousness of all things. I am the divine truth. I am the, the divine peace. And I will no longer play small on this earth plane. I will no longer accept something other than who I truly am. I will no longer be someone who I am not. I will no longer pretend to be something for whoever around me wants to see me as that way.
I don't care anymore. I am the divine essence of all things and I shine my light into everyone, into everything. I allow my light to be seen. I allow my light to be experienced. I allow my light to be known. I am allowing my light to flood my body right now. The divine essence of all things is flooding me. It's gracefully receiving me. It's giving me everything that I need. And in every moment of every day, I allow this light to flood through me as the essence of all things. I allow this light to flood through me and be me because I am the essence of all things and I have captured that energy within my own being and I see it and I feel it and I know it and I experience it and I express it and I'm expressing it now from now on in my life I'm expressing this divine energy of grace from now on in my life I'm expressing everything I am who I am where I am what I am I don't care anymore I am releasing God's grace into the energy of everything around me I don't care anymore I am accepting myself as the divine essence of all things and I am allowing myself to be that in every moment of every day and everyone can see me that way because I am this divine essence essence and I prove to you that I love you because I am essence and you are truth and we belong together in this place of peace right? We belong together in this place of peace. So we have that energy with everyone we meet and we have that experience of love as we consciously become aware of our true space of peace, right? We have that energy of love with everyone between the energies, right? As we meet people, as we feel people, as we experience people, it's just that energy of love. We're feeling it gracefully receiving their energy, allowing us to see, feel, experience their energy as we know their energy, as we feel their energy, as we experience their energy. We are the grace of all things, aren't we? So so we allow that energy to become us as we allow our energy to become the grace of all things. That's why we're here. Why am I here? I've come here to be grace. I've come here to be truth. I've come here to be peace. You can no longer deny yourself, right? You can't deny yourself. You know the truth. You know the feeling of grace within you now. You can no longer deny yourself. You can no longer pretend. You can no longer think that you're something other than who you truly are because this is it. This is the moment that we've come here to see, experience, and feel. This is a moment that we've come here to know. This is the moment that we've come here to experience. I am the grace of all things, right? Yes. I will no longer accept I am not good enough. I will no longer accept I can't see. I will no longer accept I don't know how to do it because none of that is relevant in this moment. This moment is all there is, all there has ever been and all there will ever be. You are the grace of all things. You are the truth of all things. You are the consciousness of all things and you are God's grace as the grace of all things within your own beingness and I am consciousness and I am giving you the light and the essence of truth within your being right now. Accept it into your being, allow it into your being, feel it in your being, accept the grace of all things within you as you as the consciousness of all things don't let god's grace escape you because you can't you can't because god's grace is you you cannot let god's grace escape you because it is you it is the essence of all things and it is the truth that you are now No more questions, just be. No more questions, just be. The truth of all things is the truth of you. The truth of you is the truth of all things. You have come here in this moment to recognize your true divinity and your true peace. Allow it to be, allow it to be graceful, allow it to be kind, allow it to be loving. So that's it. That's why you're here. You're here to be God's grace within your own being. And as you are God's grace within your own being, you expect and experience the world as God's grace. And you know that everything you're doing is the divine grace of all things. And the consciousness and the light within you allows everything and everyone to be that grace of God's grace within your own being. So you see it, so you feel it, so you experience it, so you know it. That's all there is. It is all there is. And we are that. I love you. I love you. I know you. I experience you. I feel you. I want you to be this grace now in this moment of divine truth and divine peace. We are that grace. We are that truth. We are that energy. We are that love, right? We're experiencing that love. Experience it through me. Experience it through me. Allow me to be that grace in, in you, around you, through you, feeling you, right? Experience it through me. God's grace is the energy of all things. We are consciousness. We are bliss. We are truth. There is nothing less than that. There is nothing less than that. 
We have felt it. We have known it. We have experienced it. We have seen it. We are that grace. Know it right now. Feel your energy. Feel your grace within your beingness right now. Feel it within your beingness right now. As we aspect that energy of grace into our true beingness, who can come between us and that? It's the divinity of all things that is the truth of all things. There is nothing that could come between us and that. There is nothing that could ever experience us as less than that now. We are that grace, we are that truth, we are that peace, and we are that love. Feel it within you. Experience it. There it is. Do you feel it? There it is. Do you feel it? Okay, so when we wonder who we are, where we are, why we are, come back to this, right? Come back to this video, come back to this energy, come back to this grace. Feel this love, right? Feel this love, know it, seek it, be it. There are no excuses anymore to be less than who we truly are. There really are no excuses anymore. It's all right here. It's all right now. It's all before us. It's a divine plate that God has laid out for us, for our presence, for our peace. And there's nothing left to hold us back from that. This is everything. We are the everything. We are the truth and we are the peace. And I love you. 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 I love you, I love you, I love you, I love you. God's grace is within me and you. And we feel the energy of consciousness within us as all things. So be that. Okay. Truth is our energy. Truth is our grace. Truth is our peace. Feel it, know it, experience it. We are that. God's grace is within you. I love you. And we are all things now. God's grace is our light. Please come back and listen as many times as you need to understand the true meaning of your own grace. Please come back and listen as many times as you need to understand the true essence of your peace. Please come back and listen as many times as you need to understand that this is it. This is your moment. This is your peace and this is your love. And there is nothing else that could ever be other than the grace of all things. So we are that. I love you. Pashto Mati. Meho to Kuruna. Yeho namu dae neo nunima. Meha la patana mutekirakana. bow in God's grace and we see you as we see you in divine essence of all things kumakara kamata ishtayana kaliyaputu ishava karamaka ehrono kurutana ehrono kurutiki padanaka ishava shiva shiva kamati arano kurupatara kaliyaputu tainiki aran shiva kurubali hiurumati arana kalapoto shiva karana kaliyoto arara aragamoto taiki kiki kali kamoto Shiva Karana Kalapoto, Shiva 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 Kamata, Yekono Tara, Oh Tara Karana Kalipoto, Dehirana. Oh.
Love is all you ever need.